Hey guys, um, today I'm going to be showing you how to install Windows Vista in VirtualBox. Um, so, what we're going to be doing is just, yeah, installing Windows Vista in VirtualBox because that's what we do. The reason I got it in like Windows Classic style is just because it makes your computer run faster. So yeah. So you're going to click New, you're going to click, um, type in the name of the operating system. If you just type in Windows Vista, it'll automatically like check it, the OS type. Click Next, 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 Next. Just kind of like, I just go really fast through it all. Um, yeah. So, then you're going to double click on the virtual machine to start it. Click OK. Um, we're going to click Next and select if you're going to go from a, if you're going to go through a ISO, you're going to click that little arrow thing next to it, but if you're not, just put the CD in your drive, click the D drive and click Next. If you, do, if you are using ISO, it will go faster. I got some crazy zooms going on there. That's a lot of keyframing. So, yeah, so we're going to let this start up. Um, yeah, I forgot to speed this up last time, so I had to redo this part, but you know, now it's going faster, so. Um, so select your language as you normally would. Um, I always get those little things, so, like, the little pop-ups, but I just click do not ask me again, and yeah. So, please wait, which I also should have sped up, but I forgot, but I don't think it's that, yeah, it has that long. So, um, you can type in a serial number if you want. I'm not going to because I don't want you guys to see my serial number. So, you're going to click no. Just kind of like go through. Um, if you type in your serial number, you won't get this next part that will ask you if you what you want to install. If you want to do alternate or like premium and all that yummy magical stuff. Um, so I'm just gonna install Ultimate because, you know, why not? Yeah. Next. Okay. Um, of course, you gotta sign your life away. Next. Custom. Um, format, uh, you don't have to format the hard drive, it'll just say unallocated space. Just kinda click on it, and you're just gonna click Next. Just click Click on it, click next, and it should start installing. After it installs and reboots a couple times, you're gonna get this. You're gonna type in your name if you want to. You don't have to. Um, I didn't type in password. Just click the picture. I'm gonna click the robots. Robots are awesome because we're gonna get taken over by robots in a couple years anyways. So yeah. Check your wallpaper and you're going to click next. Um, obviously you're gonna want it to update if you want it to. Yeah, probably a good idea. Select your time zone. I live in the Eastern time zone. I live on the East Coast. Um, so we're going to click next again, maybe, if I click it, yep, alright, uh, pick your network, home, and that's going to say thank you for choosing Windows Vista, yay, so then it's going to kind of like boot up, kind of, sort of, really, kind of, not really, I don't know, um, and it's going to do the system check, and it's going to kind of like, it's going to check your system overview, your system ratings, and all that magical, wonderful stuff.
to boot up screen, and congratulations, you have Windows Vista, but we are not done yet. Yeah, you interrupted me, you stupid sounds. So, um, after this, you're going to have to go up, and you're going to click on devices, if I ever do that. Obviously, I'm, re I'm kind of recording my voice after I did this, because I did this at like, it was like 8 o'clock at night, I really couldn't talk, because my parents were sleeping. So you're going to go up and you're going to click on devices in the main bar and if your mouse will not go up there you got to click the right control and click install system, forget what that says, I can't really see it, it's kind of blurry on my screen until it renders. Um, here I went to the computer but it just kind of popped up. So you're going to click run the um, drivers, that's basically what they are, drivers for VirtualBox so you can resize it and it will resize the screen resolution and all that magical stuff. Then you get Windows Account Control, which everyone also loves. Um, super fast mouse. And you're gonna click next, 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 next. Just like we always do, because no one ever <coughs> I dropped my phone. Because no one ever reads anything. And it's going to install. take the full screen of your computer monitor and it will fit to your screen resolution because it will auto resize and you won't have to click the little right control button to move your mouse out. So um yeah that's about it. It's very simple. Remember you gotta have you kinda gotta have a fast computer to do this or your computer will like blow up. But that's about it guys so thanks for watching please subscribe and go to my website, www.elmorgoin.tk. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later, and goodbye.